So you've lost pigment all over here. Mm -hmm. Samira Omar feared she'd be scarred for life. Some pigments I lost on the forehead. Okay. Yes. And also on the back of my neck is all scarred. The 17-year-old says she was the victim of a horrific bullying incident. It happened this past summer when living in the UK. Omar says four classmates she thought were her friends ganged up on her, beat her, and then doused her with boiling water. And I remember I looked into the mirror when I was calling for help and I could see my skin completely hanging off me, my neck was burnt, and I had like skin peeling here and here, and it just felt like as if I've been through hell and back. Omar says police are investigating her case. She's since retreated home to Canada to heal the emotional scars, but she thought she'd always bear the physical ones until she met Basma Hamid. We'll make sure we cover all these areas, but it will take a series of treatments. It's called paramedical tattooing treatments. And over a period of months, Hamid will conceal Omar's scars by tattooing pigment that matches her natural skin tone. For her to tell me, you know, I could actually have your colour come back was just something amazing. Hamid's skills are sought after by patients from around the world. Here she treats Nafi Nazambe, who burned her hand while cooking. She's good. So I can smile now because of her. So I have hope. Nzambe saw results after her first session. This part was white, as this one, but yeah. now it's black. My normal skin color. Hamid's first patient was herself. At age two, she was severely burned by hot oil in a kitchen accident. After more than 100 painful procedures, the scars remained. I was told by my plastic surgeon that I needed to take my money and go, and, uh, go on a vacation. So for me, I felt like that wasn't the end of the road. And it wasn't. She discovered this emerging field of cosmetic tattooing. Once trained, she transformed her own face and then started a business, transforming the lives of others. She quickly earned a reputation. Basma has perfected her one-of-a-kind technique. My experience has definitely helped me to not give up, to continue to grow and to continue to help as many people as possible. Oh, Thank you. You're beautiful. You're so beautiful. Thank you so much, Basma. Okay. Hamid will help young Omar for free. She has to wait a few more months to heal before beginning treatment. Brush it upwards. For now, Hamid shows her how to use a scar concealer that she developed, again, by experimenting on herself. Already, just Omar is seeing a positive change. A great finish, honestly. Thank you so much. Sophia Harris, CBC News, Toronto.